Welcome back to Foul Mouth Fishing. Um, I wanted to do a real quick five minute uh, breakdown of some helpful tips to save you money when you're out fishing. Um, something that came to mind, uh, especially in the cold weather months, are protecting your hands um, from the cold water and fish and, and, and things. Now fish have a lot of things that are natural to protect them from predators. Uh, catfish have spines on the back of their, their dorsal fin. Uh, bass have teeth and of course they have those rigid uh, spines in their, in their fins and some fish have slime and some other things that might uh, cause rashes on your skin, if, especially if you're allergic to fish. Um, so one of the greatest things uh, a fisherman can get, an angler can get, is a pair of fishing gloves. But looking out at different places, bass, bass uh, pro shops and tackle stores, you're looking at $20, $30, $40 for a pair of adequate fishing gloves. So what I want to do in this quick video is just explain a, a solution, a substitution that I came up with for that. Rather than spend $40 on fishing gloves and apparel just for a name brand, I bought for $4.99 a pair of exercise gloves. These are a breathable neoprene material similar to wetsuits. They've got a little Velcro clasp. They're the same five finger. They give me the same dexterity uh, to manipulate everything from my, my uh, pliers to my uh, split ring uh, pliers, etc. Grabbing the fish, no problem. But they allow me to protect my hands from getting barbs in my palm, their padded padded glove. Uh, this also helps to protect you from UV light, which if you have a family member or relatives that are prone to uh, skin cancer, that's something you gotta think about. A lot of people don't think about protecting their hands, which are constantly exposed to the sun while they have on you know, their, their nose protection and they have their sunglasses and their hats and their UV protectant shirts. They don't think, protect your hands. Uh, to prevent from getting skin cancer that way because that's something that us anglers need to be cognizant of when we're out there on the water or out on the bank because that's constantly having that sunlight come off that water and, and hit us. Um, so to make this most beneficial as a fishing substitute, what I will say is instead of spending the $30, $40, dollars on a pair of fishing gloves, I bought these for $4.99 and I invested in something that I actually have around the house all the time, which is... Uh, this is Kiwi brand. Uh, there's two different varieties I have. This is the Camp Dry, which I actually prefer. Uh, there's a, a heavy duty boot waterproofant. And this one here is by Herman, which is a, at an outfit store that I got. This is another silicon, um, or silicone if you want to call it, uh, waterproofing spray. So picking up one of these cans of sprays for five more dollars, um, I prefer this Kiwi Camp Dry only because this is specifically designed for breathable apparel, uh, things like Gore-Tex uh, and other materials that you want to continue to breathe. And if you, if you know, this has a few holes in it to allow you to, to breathe so that your skin's not sweating profusely inside the glove. Um, but saturating this material, you know, a few good coats with uh, this waterproofing agent definitely gives you a hydrophobic style protected glove that you can use for fishing. It's not $30, $40, $50 $50 like you would get at Dick's or, or at Bass Pro Shops for their fishing gloves. It was $4.99. You can tear this, throw it out, get another one for $4.99. Definitely saves you money in the long run and adds a level of protection that every angler needs. So I just wanted to give this quick tip in this little five minute video and that's my idea is to come up with more of these five minute quick more palatable videos to show quick cheap tips to save money while fishing uh, with little substitutions. Um, I hope that this video was informative. I hope this gave you an idea to save some money and definitely to go out and get some gloves, especially with the springtime coming up, to protect your hands from, you know, chafing, holding the, uh, the reel and, and getting that rub on your, on your palms. Um, it's definitely beneficial. Uh, if you like this video, comment in the description down or in the, uh, in the comments below. Um, Definitely do us a favor, like this video, share this video with as many people as you know, share it as many, uh, many posts as you can, um, subscribe and hit that bell notification so when I do more of these little quick five minute videos to help you out with quick tips on how to save money on things, um, tackle bags, uh, different ways to stow your tackle, etc., that uh, you're, you're up to date and informed when I do post these videos. Uh, my best wishes and luck. If you're out there today, it's very cold. Stay warm and stay dry um, for those out in these terrible, terrible conditions. But uh, I wish you all the best of luck and happy fishing. Uh, this has been Foul Mouth Fishing, and uh, good luck and God bless.